<laughs> All right, her dating life is beyond abundant, and you don't have the glitter sticks on. You look even more beautiful, Yay, so I have to say thank that. you. All right. I would love to see you at home, knock on the door and surprise you. After you've done the makeup special. Oh, yeah. No, I'm not, I'm, yeah, like it's very kind. I put lipstick on before I go to bed. Do you do that? Oh, all the time, every night. I'm, I'm a, no, I mean, I put lipstick on and then I go to bed. Me too. <laughs> to have sexy dreams, right? <laughs> Real quick, we're here yes, for Farm Sanctuary. I want to look good for my dreams, yes. I don't think you can look bad. Now, you said Stifler's mom made you have a lot of beautiful dates, but yeah. this event, Farm Sanctuary, you said you like people, but animals is your passion. It is. I mean, you know, I, I look, I do a lot of fundraisers over the years, and I have to say, like, is there one that I don't like and, you know, don't want to support? No, I would, you know, that's why I go to them, because it's something I feel strongly about. But, um, you know, there's just something incredibly hard to take when an animal is being abused. It's just beyond... It's beyond what a lot of people can marry. And you know what? I think it's a really good barometer for, like... I know I hate to say this, but it's for... A good person or someone who doesn't have empathy is like if you if you aren't good to animals, then I think there's something really wrong with you, and um, you have to be borderline sociopath or um, which they often are. I think you wind up killing people. Yes, yes. But I mean, not only that, it's just like uh, it just to me seems incredibly odd to be a human being that doesn't care about animals. That just seems. Um, uh, Inhuman. And what? Inhuman. You, yes, you like that quality. Really, yes, yes, yes. And who would want to hang out with one of those? I certainly don't. As Bill Murray said, any dog doesn't like somebody, I don't like that person either. Right? I know. And you want to know something else? I always hit it off with someone at a party or at the shampoo bowl at my hairdressers or whatever, and I hit it off with people, and later I'll go to an animal event and they're all there. Yeah. You know what I mean? They're all animal people. They're all animal people. Like, And you don't even know. You're just attracted to, I guess it's you're attracted to kind, cool people. That's the, that's the commonality between all of them. If you love animals, you're probably a good person. Yes. And now everybody has to stand up, back these type of charities, and show the world we can't have it that you have to have products that say cruelty-free, as if that's acceptable in any No, I know. Same. I know. I mean, you know, uh, well, it's interesting because, and then, you know, this is the other thing. It's like... How do they gauge cruelty free? Oh. You know what I mean? Like that's another thing. You know, when they say cruelty free, it's like what? Because you know their eyes don't pop out, or you know, like it's it's like um, even that. Like you know, and then there's a whole debate about the free range. Oh yeah, thing. eighty million of them in a small room. Yes, yes. It's sort of like oh no, but they're 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 walking around. No, they're not. They're walking on to, on top of each other. Yeah, they're it, trampling each other. Yes, yes, yes. So, I like that. You know what you're talking about. Not just hot. She knows what she's doing. But, um, I see the videos. That's how you know. I just the cow video. Yes. And you know what I think? You know, you're a very young girl. It's all these young girls. It's like she's talking to her. Yes, I'm talking to young people. It's like they just need the videos. They need the videos sent to them. That's how I got. Uh, that's how I got educated. People were sending them to me, and now I can get them on YouTube, and I, they don't have to send them anymore. Yeah. That's what we need, the exposure. And no anti-gag laws where you go to jail for filming something like whistleblowing on a factory. Have you seen that I gag? Oh my God. Is that mental patient running the, you know, the oh zoo? Oh my God, I know that, the, that these guys are getting protected now. Lobbyists, money. Oh my God. Well, we gotta... That's it, we're going rioting in the streets and you put on that full clown makeup. All right. All right. No, I don't want. I know. I want people to know who I am. I don't. I don't need the clown makeup for that. I need clown makeup for the rest of my life. But um, but no, I want um, we we um, no masks for. I think the more we go out there and um, the more honest crusaders we are and reveal ourselves and then say on every talk show that you know animal cruelty, you know factory farming has to stop. You know all of that. The more we just say it as ourselves, um, I, that's that's the power. Of it. And that's how we'll solve it: strength in numbers and Miss Jennifer. Yes. We're out, Chance TV. Thank you.